Hey, what's going on guys? It's Al here, and today I've got an unboxing for you guys. So this is another Al's review for you. And, uh... That's not the product today. Today, I have for you guys the Noisy Cricket 225. So we're gonna go ahead and unbox it. Now, first thing you get is the device itself, which is very pretty. And it's already got fingerprints on it. I have it in my hand for a fucking second and it's already got fucking fingerprints on it. Joking. Ah, oh, fuck it. Alright, well, that means that we can kiss the original Noisy goodbye. Oh shit. I'll worry about that later. Now, this, this device doesn't have a screen. It has a potentiometer. This is what you use to control the uh, wattage. Yeah. If you want to control the wattage at all. Now, I believe, yeah, this battery door doesn't have a USB pass through. Now, with the batteries, you can swap between series and parallel from the little chip in the battery door. You just pop it on there like that for series and like that for parallel. That's upside down, I'm sorry. No, this is all. It's upside down, I'm sorry, guys. Um. So I'm, I'm gonna just leave it in series how I found it. I also got another box here, which I'm assuming yeah, is the batteries. Two LG HE4s, 2500 milliamp hours, standard shit. I don't need this box either. Now is anything else in the device box? Oh, there's a little warning. What's this warning say? Please be careful not to use batteries and cord casings as it, as it is a safety hazard. That's been a rule for Noisy since day one. Those fuckers are annoying as hell. Now we got the little sleeve right now. Right there. And yeah, there's the quick guide. Come out. There we go. I like throwing shit if you can't tell. Now, this is just a quick guide telling us the overview, how to use it. Now I've already seen a couple of videos on how to use it, so I'm pretty much good. Um, so pretty much it's got atomizer protection, short circuit protection, low voltage protection. It flashes based on the percentage of the battery for 60 to 100 percent and stays lit. 30 to 59 flashes slowly, 10 to 29 flashes moderately, and 9 percent to dead flashes frequently. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and pop the batteries in the device. Now they both go in positive end at the top of the device. Yeah, they both go in the same way. We're going to smack this battery door on there. Come on, you fuck. Okay, it's in. Oh, it's already on. Turns on as soon as you fucking put the batteries in. That, that's the LED it has on it. I'm gonna go ahead and take my RDA, my j -Bow Indestructible, onto the j -Bow Wismac Noisy for the true j -Bow Wismac experience. Now, I believe orange is controlled or direct wattage, so that's gonna be varied based on the uh, potentiometer. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and leave it where it is, which is almost full power. Damn. Alright. Let's go ahead. Not bad, not bad. It seems like a pretty durable mod. Uh, that kind of seems like the coil's limits. So I'm not going to push it any farther than that. So, uh, yeah. Noisy Cricket 225. I'll do, I'll do another review on it maybe later during the week, telling you my thoughts on it. I This device is $35 from Vapor King. So, uh, yeah. With that, I'm going to end the video here. I'll put a link in the description, possibly, if I can. Once again, that's my time. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. And as always, my name's Al. This is my mod. See you later.